There is no better time than today to acknowledge our gifted learners who have showcased their talents in various platforms. With that focus, 
it is my privilege and honor to express a warm welcome to the chief guest for today's program, Thirumano Tangraj, Honorable Minister for Information Technology, <laughs> Government of Tamil Nadu, who was kind enough to readily accept our invitation and agree to grace this occasion with his presence. A very heartfelt welcome, sir, to you on behalf of the management and all gathered here. A warm welcome is also extended to our guest of honor, Dr. S. Gomati Nayagam, former executive director, <laughs> National Institute of Wind Energy, our director and CEO, Dr. Anand Jacob Vergis, <laughs> principal, dean, principals and teachers from various schools, heads of the departments, faculty, and my dear young leaders of future India. Engineers 2022 is one such event to showcase the talents of school students and also motivate them to develop their interest in engineering and technology. We are indeed happy to have each one of you on campus and hope you have enjoyed your time with us. I congratulate all the students who have participated in this wonderful event to exhibit their talents and the faculty across schools and each one of those hardworking souls who have worked tirelessly to make this event a very grand success. I am sure that the stars present here would definitely shine one day and that day is not very far. Wishing you all the very best. And I must really thank the team of faculty and students of KCG who have put this initiative together. So congratulations to each one of you for that. And not to leave the schools, the principals and teachers who have made it possible to motivate their students to come here to attend the various workshops organized by our students here to understand what is technology. When we felt a few years back that there are very few people who understand technology. My uh, remembrance goes way back to 95 when the information technology course was launched by the AICT and the government and there was a big rush for this program and many said yes uh, of course it will uh, change the landscape and all that and uh, still there was a big uh, rush for mechanical, civil and all those subjects but we found that information technology took over most of these areas became embedded into all the subjects in merely 30 years we didn't know what was information technology we thought it was just a subject but today you are breathing and living that. And today we have the valedictory function and the inauguration of the Center of Artificial Intelligence and Data Science at this institution, creating their laboratory facility and the research facility. However, I welcome our Honorable Minister for IT, who is spearheading the efforts of our state in IT to make it a trillion dollar economy's backbone of the country especially connecting with the government's initiative of setting up a deep tech innovation hub, I Tamil Nadu Tech or ITNT, which will work on areas such as climate tech, space tech, robotics, healthcare, Web3, and many other sectors. I hope that KCG College will ultimately be in a unique position to showcase how AI can be applied safely and responsibly for the benefit of everyone. Let me conclude. Now, dear students, I'm sure many of you here will be aspiring for careers in the plethora of programs showcased here, and we wish you all success in your careers. Thank you and best wishes to all the ingenious minds gathered here, and wishing you all a happy Tamil New Year. My dear students and young minds, I'm here to convey five minutes something to you. The Tamil Nadu government's initiatives are very excellent. I think all of you might be knowing by now, in Tamil Nadu, in India, out of total electricity generated, 40% of the energy comes from wind and solar. This is comparable to Netherlands, which is number one in the world, if you take as a region. We are really proud to uh, say that the present government probably we are entering into a golden era with a very dynamic, highly qualified uh, ministers under the leadership of the, our chief minister. And we are uh, entering into newer and newer uh, strides in wind energy and solar energy in this way. 
without data what is information processed data is information information technologies so it is going into everything today if you have read the newspaper today or yesterday apollo has done a robotic heart surgery for a 93 year old man so which is possible only with ai and robotics and artificial intelligence neural network and data science and uh, our honorable minister has recently held a nunnariv 21 artificial intelligence 21 uh, one day workshop which is a very grand success and he is uh, on the rampage to give high speed fiber connectivity 1 gigabyte uh, connectivity to all, every village and india in india uh, recently 10th april 2022 niti ayog's uh, release uh, tamil nadu is number one in energy efficiency 85% no other state is uh, coming to that level of score 85% in india even though overall sdg tamil nadu is ranking now 9 this has to go uh, completely different about 50% uh, energy usage is should be from direct application of electricity then only you can reduce the carbon uh, 36.9 gigatons of carbon we have to remove by 2050 to do that 50% of the our energy usage should be from electrical and that electricity generated should be 90% using only renewables only 10% from the coal so it is you the students should be aware that how we can solve this climate crisis and energy crisis pollution free environment answer is a a for act now act now and then save energy uh, world's energy resources if you put that it will be a answer that's the answer what are the tools tools you are going to use you have to use r r r that is reduce the usage of energy which will put carbon in the atmosphere number one number two reuse whatever is possible number three recycle with these three words i thank the organizers for giving me an opportunity to come respected president of this function dr anand jacob burgis dear dr gobind nayagam former executive director of national institute of indian energy <coughs> dr ani jacob director of this esteemed institution and the principal of this college dr deva sundari dear faculty members and dignitaries of the dais students from uh, various schools and students of this college i am very happy to be here with all of you in this wonderful occasion and uh, i am very happy that center of artificial artificial intelligence is being inaugurated today really it gives me immense pleasure because i have heard lot about this uh, institution that is kcg college of technology and also the group of colleges which belong to the hindustan group of colleges and i am very happy to note that we are very proud of we being tamil people wherever we go you know they say that tamil nadu has very good uh, education institutions it is a good strength in our part and really i am very happy that uh, this college the kcg college of technology is contributing much to our state and uh, i am very happy to note that so what next we are going to do we have signed the treaty on the carbon option i think we have to bring down and we have to survey the existence of the world is under question under threat actually i think when i was in the assembly i was just going through a message and somebody sent me a message it states that some scientific uh, team has uh, come up with an uh, a finding that within another 9 years 40% of tamil nadu's coastal villages will be in the sea so what kind of threat we are facing because we are polluting the space like anything so we need to think in the other way why i am telling this there is a very good scope for solar energy wind energy and all other kind of renewable energy anyway technology is going to be the thing that is going to dictate our day to day life it has started so there is a good scope for students in all these fields and there is no second thought in that i really appreciate the students who have come and participated in the 
program and i really congratulate the people who win the awards and uh, people who don't get an award or certificate don't worry about all those things this is just a motivation that's all if you don't get also you can <laughs> achieve so many things in your life so wish you all the best i once again thank this kcg college Every little step we take with his guidance transforms several lives and subsequently aims at transforming the world. A segment of today's program, I am sure, would definitely transform the lives of many students here as it would have given them a fair knowledge on making their higher education choices. So, your timely advice on executing academic and CSR activities has been helping us in achieving the vision and mission of the institution. Thank you very much, sir. Our director, Dr. Annie Jacob, is detail-oriented, and she has been with us, encouraging and supporting us in all possible ways. She has never turned down any proposal that benefits student community. Hosting an event of this kind exclusively for school children for the fourth time on the campus is one testimony to show her interest towards the betterment of student community. Thank you very much, ma'am, for all your support and guidance. I take this opportunity to thank the management, principals, and staff of schools for their efforts in sending their students to our campus. In fact, this morning, we had 2,000 students from 30 different schools participating in 17 workshops 13 contests and four events in our campus. I appreciate each and every student for your interest and curiosity to learn, to learn by participating and doing. This attitude will take you to greater heights. Best wishes from KCG College of Technology to each and every one of the students here. I would be failing my duty if I fail to thank the executive members, overall coordinators of the program, heads of the departments, event coordinators, faculty, and all my students, administrative staff, for your contribution in making this program a success. I would like to end my thanks note with the following quote. Small acts, when multiplied by millions of people, can transform the world. Dear all, big or small, your contribution really matters. Thank you so much.
Thank you.